unwavering commitment. That's what I told my niece last year when she came up to me at Thanksgiving dinner. She's studying over at Penn State. She wanted to know what it takes to work at Allerton Brown. We produce and distribute more pharmaceuticals, life-saving drugs, than anyone else on the planet. I told my niece, to be in this business, you have to fight for it. Protect it at all costs. Make sacrifices. It must be your religion. And when you think that your colleague, someone you consider a friend, even a brother, when you think that person is doing something wrong, like stealing, you have to make it right. Sometimes you have to do whatever it takes to save the company. Even break into a room. today. He said they didn't need a technical guy, even though no one knows the research like I do. for five years. All variations. Everything you need to survive with God's grace. Hey, hey, Mike. Mike. <laughs> How many more of these we got? Okay. <laughs> Folks, these are selling fast. If you want to be ready for the apocalypse, I urge you to order now. Provide for your loved ones. This bucket has enough pea soup for a family of seven for a whole year. And that is what we're preparing for here, folks. End times. Now, I want y'all to understand, the day of reckoning is coming. I don't want to see you caught with your pants down. You gotta think ahead. Highest grade food safe plastic. <coughs> and it's reusable. Made right here in the great state of Texas. It stays sealed through anything. Speaking of seals, remember, Revelations 6-2. And I looked before me, and I beheld a white horse. Upon that horse was a rider, and in his hand was a bow, and they placed a crown upon his head, and he looked like a conqueror, bent on conquest. Wait. Now, I'm not gonna lie. Kevin? Sometimes I open one of these suckers up, but I don't feel like groceries. Yeah? My friends and family came to me and said, What the fuck are you doing in there? Why are you making these kids? So big. That's what they got me. What the fuck are you doing? Make them smaller and we can sell a whole lot more. And I just said, well, you know. This is my room. I know that you mean well, but y'all are suffering from the disease. And a lot of people these days are suffering from the disease. They want to cut corners and they want to get a fast buck. But that's not going to work in the apocalypse. We're all going to have to work together to make this product, to make our lives better for all of us. And that's what we're talking about here, folks. Death, the apocalypse. Trying to prepare for the upcoming end times. I want y'all to understand that we have prepared these buckets, food sources, for all of I can't let you destroy this company. Generations to come. What are you talking about? We've got The kickback got schemes. We've got jello. We've I got proof. Ice cream for that that you, need. 
You need to leave. Right now. I had businessmen come to me, and these guys are corporate guys, and they make a lot of money. I'm not going anywhere. You really fucking lost it. What are you doing? Oh, we're not doing this. You're done. I want nothing but the best for my friends, my family, for you people out there. You are just thinking of your family. You are thinking of all of humanity. Because you know, the people of the true faith. And we all know who we are. Yeah, hi, is this the fucking... We are the people who you build and repop. Hey, what the fuck are you doing? When it all goes down. So I say to you, my friend. Give me, my give me my club, my sisters. Know the truth, and the truth will set you free. I want you to admit that you've been taking kickbacks. I haven't. Then explain this. I found it in your trash. You've been trying to get rid of it. We're closing the lab in China. My lab will get you another lab. The research, the money is just, it's not there. Well, because you and Paul and Richard and everybody else are bleeding the company dry. No, that is your conspiracy bullshit. You wouldn't have a lab if it wasn't for us. Oh, you're gonna hit me with that? We were so close. Why would you do this? It's just business. We had to make cuts before the merger. Merger? We don't need a merger. This will be good for all of us. It will be good for your mortgage payments, you greedy fuck. What happened to saving lives? We all want that. Nothing's changed. Not for self, but for others, right, buddy? Four and a half years in fucking China. You've been through a lot. My wife? Be all right. All those patients. We just ran the numbers, it's just not. Numbers. to my research. I don't, I 
don't know. Just y'all know. I myself, I got 40 of these buried up in my backyard. You can have them too. No closing the lab. No merger. Everything the way it was. I'll tell him to keep your lab, okay? That's just up to me, though. Mm, mm, mm. Don't that look good? You gotta eat right. You eat right, and you can be right. Stop the stealing. Save the research. Save the company. Stop the merger. If your right hand offends you, cut it off. Not for self, but for others. Right, buddy? of God sent out into all the earth. And he went and took the scroll from the right hand of him that sat upon the throne. Order now, only In 1886, Dr. Theodore Lazar injected himself with a type 3 Hemings virus. He died from complications of the disease. But before he died, he found the cure. so good. 